Predator Poachers and CC Unit. Um, you know, this is the one where they catch a pedophile. Let's just be very fucking clear. Um, pedophile on a Indian reservation. Here's the thing about this video. In some ways, it was kind of a shit show. It was kind of a shit show for damn near every person that was involved in it. Um, even CC Unit to some extent, not because of what he said, more of what he didn't say. Um, you know, it starts where, you know, they doing some sort of fake thing or whatever to try to get you know, the predator come outside, and then later on they confront them, and they're like, you know, you're doing this, you're doing that, what's going on, yada, yada, yada. Meanwhile, you have his family members or whatever, like, kind of like peeking through the window to see what's going on. Now, here's the thing about that. To an extent, to an extent, I understand where the family's coming from. Because at the end of the day, they're not there protecting their 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 child, their their grandson, whatever. I, I get it. Um, and I get where Alex is coming from too. I I on an emotional level, I completely a hundred percent agree with the fact that you know he was upset with them trying to shield him, you know, trying to shield this fucking pedophile, you know, they were sniffing this thing, well, don't say anything, just, just keep your mouth shut, you know, go back inside, and, you know, I, 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 I totally, I totally understand where he's coming from, because at that point, it just makes everyone there that is defending him look just as bad, and I, I completely agree with that, um, there was a couple of things that Alex did say that I felt like just went out of pocket. And I hate saying this because I was just more or less fucking praising him on my last video with, with Dap. Um, he said some sort of comment in the beginning, some sort of some sort of racial comment about, um, you know, Indians in the beginning. And I'm like, Ugh, okay. You know, and then, you know, the guy's like, you know, are you being racist or whatever? I mean, granted, to, to an extent, you really, like, you, <laughs> you don't have a fucking leg to stand on. Just, just shut up and take it. But then at one point, this is, this is, and this is where everyone's kind of ganging up on them. You know, the family's ganging up on Alex and everything like that. And, you know, they're going in on him. And, um, you know, Alex says something along the lines of, you know, Indians aren't really, you know, like, Indians aren't really, like, the, you know, have the smartest IQ or something. And I'm like, Ugh. Now, I've watched CC Unit for a while. Um, like I said, the dude's always, um, very professional. He has a style that's very similar to Pop Squad. So, you know, I've always loved, you know, I still always love watching his videos and stuff. But I gotta sit there and say, you know, when you, you know, when you're with him and you watch him say some of the stuff that he says, and you're not checking him on that, because, you know, at the end of the day, yeah, it's too, it's a clap video, but, like, you know, right or wrong, stuff that he's saying, like, it does kind of, you know, it doesn't look good for you, because it just makes him come across as somewhat complacent, complicit. Now, I'm not just saying, you know, oh, just go and defend the pedophile, but, like, I mean, you ain't even look at him sideways, you be like, yo, Alex, show or whatever, like, that's not what we're here for, like, come on. And at some point, you know, because Alex is getting upset, he's getting pissed off or whatever, and he uses a lot of foul language, and while that's all good and great, I guess his grandmother was out there, and his grandmother must be, like, 80, 85, something years old or whatever, you know how it is. With older people, there's certain things you don't say, you kind of watch him off or whatever, and, you know. And Alex was, you know, I guess because his grandmother was not there saying something to him or whatever. And Alex was, like, just cursing and, you know, showing graphic pictures and stuff. And I'm like, bro, this is, like, <laughs> come on, what, what are you doing? Why are you showing them graphic fucking pictures? I mean, at some point, 
I don't know if the mother or somebody said it was like, yo, we understand what he did was wrong. Like, we're not condoning it, you know? So showing them pictures of, you know, the guy's fucking junk isn't, you know what I'm saying? It isn't winning. It isn't winning them over, you know? So it just turns into a big, complete fucking mess. And, you know, then then the cop comes over. They're, you know, their cop comes over whatever. And, you know, they pretty much kind of escort them off the property a little bit. And, my goodness, I'm not going to lie, um, there was a couple of things that I, from, from Alex's point of view that, or just my own point of view that I start to get kind of frustrated with. It. When they were sent there trying to explain to her why they were there and, and everything like that and trying to sit there and say, hey, listen, he is messaging you know, eight-year-old girls and stuff like that to try to get them to come over and stuff. And it's like she wasn't really understanding what they were saying. And I, I don't understand. I don't know if it was like, I, I, I don't know. I don't know if um, English was her first language. I don't understand. But it's like they had to sit there and keep re-explaining shit over and over and over again. And like after, at one point, like, you know, Ghost is they're trying to explain, and she's like, all right, you know, chill or whatever, like, well, I mean, if you're not understanding it from his point of view, you might want to sit there and listen to him, so I, it is something else that she was sitting there saying that kind of rubbed me the wrong way in the beginning, she was like, you know, we're kind of a sovereign, you know, we're a sovereign nation, we have our own laws and stuff like that, and I'm like, so, you, what, you sitting there saying, like, is it's cool, and you're fucking in, in your area that, you know, y'all just talk to fucking underage kids. Like, what What are you saying? I, I felt like she was not doing a good fucking job as far as, like, representing, like, you know, reservations and stuff like that. Like, she was not... I mean, she explained it later on, like, that they weren't. But, like, in the beginning, I was like, what does that mean? And she kept saying there saying, like, you know, if you're going to be doing this type of stuff and going on, you know, wherever, you need to understand the laws. And... I, I have to agree, you know, it, going on a reservation is literally like going into another country. It's just, you can't go to another, you can't go to fucking Africa or Egypt and be like, all right, you know, we're going to confront you and yada, yada, yada. Like that's, that's how it may, how it may work in America, but like, you know, in their own jurisdiction or whatever, you know, that's not, so she did have a point. And like I said, the whole thing was kind of a shit show. And I, I, I do wish that Ghost did say something, you know, because I've watched a, a ton of fucking Ghost videos and not once has he said something that was like racist or like, you know, making fun of somebody's like disability, whatever, you know, he's never like crossed that line. Alex, on the other hand, has. And I do feel like they, I do feel like they could be a very good, um, you know, a very good tag team, you know, because Ghost does seem like he's the more rational one, you know, in the situation. And I, and granted, as much as I understand where Alex is coming from, and I, like, on an emotional level, I completely agree, there was a better way of handling that situation. There was. It was just a better way of to handle that situation. Um, and this isn't, this isn't like, you know, me saying that they hate on him or anything like that, or, you know, like, I've liked a lot of his other videos, and he definitely improved, and I don't, I don't necessarily, like, I'm not trying to, like, bag on Alex in, like, a negative way, because, one, you're dealing with a fucking predator, the, the worst scum of the fucking earth, that deserves no, um, respect, you know? But still, you know, and it was, it wasn't just once, it was twice. Now I get it when the family came out and they, they got at him, like, I, I fucking get it. But, you know, it, it's just one of those things, like, it happened and it sucked. And at the end, like, you can tell halfway through, like, a quarter way through or whatever, it was like, yo, they're not going to get anything more out of this guy. Because this guy's shutting down. You practically just said something racist to him. You're... Pretty much like cursing and using foul language in front of his grandmother. Like he's going to shut down. So it's like. I don't know. I don't know. Um, 
that one was done on Christmas, so I know I'm kind of late to it. I know there's another video that he's he's did and like he's done, and I might sit there and do a video on it. I don't I don't know. Um, I kind of want to give my thoughts on it because like halfway through, like my fucking blood was starting to boil when they were defending him. Like I was like, are you fucking serious? Like just go inside. Like yo, he's sitting there fucking with eight year old kids, and y'all just. Y'all just worried about him getting off your fucking property? Are you kidding me? You should be sitting there trying to get him help. Is what you should be doing. Um, they're like, oh, you know, we're going to sit there and talk to the tribe and, you know, yada, yada, yada. I'm like, I'm telling you right now. I'm pretty sure that the people in the fucking tribe has fucking children. I don't think they're going to be too fucking pleased with what your son or grandson is doing. Um, yeah, it, it was... Mm. Anyway, that's just my thoughts. Let me know what you let me know what you um think about this, the video that that happened. Um, he posted it on Christmas, so let me know what your thoughts are down below. Thank you for watching. Be safe. I will catch you in the next video.